Hey guys and girls, welcome to the Silver Case. This isn't a new game, it came out a few years ago, I think in 1999. It's by Suda51, whoever of you know him know probably how this game will go, because let's just say his games are a little bit weird. Yeah, so this game came out before and got a remaster. I think last week on Steam and PC and as you can see you can change not much in the graphics but you can play pretty much the original game. You could for example change the music to original but we wouldn't hear this in the main menu. So let's get back and start a new game. New game. We could play it in Japanese, but I wouldn't understand anything, so let's go with English. Who are you? Let's see, who am I? Yeah, Lambda Delta doesn't fit, so we just go with Lambda. Okay. Lunatics. Kanto government's special administrative region, 24 wards. In accordance with the increasing population, it has been seg segmentalized into five areas. Okay. Among the inhabitants selected by public vote, 80% are poor and 20% are wealthy, creating a rift in the economic strata. Okay. The mouse most outstanding source of conflict among the classes is caused not by the difference in income, but by the discord between those with easy access to information and those without. So basically internet, or what? The number of crimes has skyrocketed and related information is propagated using news shows and communication intelligence networks as media. Yeah, internet I guess. A population of 100,000 people. Mayor Hachizuka, 
Hachisuka enters his fifth term of office. The Metropolitan Police Department's heinous crimes unit is an organization that immediately eradicates transmittable crimes. It is a group of experts coordinated by Chief Special Agent Shinji Kotobuki, an investigator who made a name for himself with the Silver Case. Guess that's why the game is called the Silver Case. Silver Case had and former regional special agent, also known as the man who arrested Kamui. 24 Area 2nd Heinous Crimes Division Special Agent Jesus Christ. Tetsugoro Kusabi was on his way home. Tetsugoro Kusabi, age 44. It happened one night in the dead of winter. Bank. Okay. So, I played the first chapter of this already just to see if it works or not and... It's a little bit different from games these days, but you get used to it. And it's very, very interesting. The music is great too. Yeah, and this guy is <laughs> fucking awesome, I guess. <laughs> what is this? A fucking lullaby? Fucking radio. Playing nothing but shit. Was this road really this long? On nights like this, weird shit happens. That's just the way it is. Quite a bumpy road. What? I got a bad feeling. A real bad feeling. Ooh. Oh no! He's carrying a hat. Yeah, a man, not, not a hat that matters. It's the man, of course. The hell is that? Guess he can see it as well as we do. Now he saw it. Oh! Nice gun. And nice reaction, seriously. <laughs> to dodge a bullet like that? Wow. He took a shot, that fucking punk. Why don't you just drive him over or something? That punk is crazy. His ass is going down for sure. Yeah. This is Kusabi. Anybody there? Respond. This is Hachisuka. Where's Sumio? He left. Oh. Something happened? A man with a gun just fired shots and fled near the river in E Ward. Call in the closest units. Where to? He's heading west in E3. Got it, we'll pinpoint him from here. So they can track him, I guess. Have you been injured? Nope, I just dodged a fucking bullet like a hero. Yeah, I dodged the slug. Watched it whiz right by. Huh? Yeah. Would be my reaction as well, I guess. Nothing yet? Got it. Where? Is it within your jurisdiction? Hold on. Public safety? Those covert ops guys? Natsumas guys, huh? Okay, call them in. Got it. Shit. Thank God it's Friday, my ass. 
Yeah, the game is full of these little animations, I guess. It's just the way it was back then, in 1999, with a limited budget. No pinpoint yet? Target pinpointed. Cauliflower. Okay. The private railroad satellite. Perfect place to lie low. I'm gonna rush to the spot. Send a location to Natsume for me. Got it. Sorry, I can't read it. <laughs> I'm not good enough with Japanese, I guess. So, the first mayor of the 24 wards, Kaoru Hashizuka, launched the government's anti-conflict reforms. With the Department of Communications and Department of Finance structured around the former TRO, and the Department of the Environment and Department of Investment structured around the former CCO, he fostered the sweeping organizational reforms to success. God damn. Who wrote this? Seriously. But the Department of Security with the Central Police Department's Heinous Crimes Division, former TRO faction, and the Public Security Department's Secret Security Division, former CCO faction, was comprised of two separate factions. Yeah. Okay. The Public Safety Department, to compete with the Heinous Crimes Division, established the Republic Special Forces Unit to handle secret security cases. Silver Case Head and former Regional Investigation Unit Investigator Daigo Natsume was offered a position of commander. Natsume then scouted Sakamoto, Inomata and Lambda for the unit. That's me! So we are just four guys? Okay. For the Republic's first campaign, they ironically run into the heinous crimes division. Okay. As Natsume and Kusabi's fates intertwine, the dark clouds of the silver case loom. A long night lies ahead for Daigo Natsume. Bank. Cauliflower. Guess this is our destination then. This is obviously a Volkswagen. Republic Raker. A detective under A jurisdiction is already en route to the scene. Cauliflower. This is a satellite, I guess. Satellite building. The target is at Cauliflower in E3. We are currently closest to the scene. We need to pretend we just happened upon the scene. HQ confirmed the target and made a decision to get us involved. That means that this is a secret security authorized case. Keeping our movements under wraps is our top priority. But unfortunately a jurisdiction detective happened upon the scene, making things a bit difficult. Okay. The Kusabi guy I guess. We need to keep the amount of info let out at a minimum. You may come into contact with the detective, but avoid any unnecessary contact at all costs. G 
Chief, what about contact in the range of level W or higher? Disposal will be a problem. Keep it at level Y or below. Got it. I'll explain his plan simply. Save questions for afterward. Armament of level X or below has been approved. What you carry is up to you. After entering Cauliflower in E3, lead the target to the Cauliflower Roof. Proceed with disposal. That is all. Any questions? Chief, how should we carry out disposal? You shoot him, I guess. <laughs> I'll leave that up to you. I'll provide remote support. What if capture is possible? I believe I said this, that this was a secu secret security authorized case. Do you need me to explain further so I guess they can't just capture him? They need to shoot him? That will not be necessary. Yeah, shut your mouth. Rookie. Anything else? That is all. Just because this is your real fi this is your first real fight. Wow. All of these guys are new to the job. Doesn't mean you need to be overly vigilant. He who masters his own mind smiles in the end. Stay relaxed till you reach the scene. Look at these guys. <laughs> Inomata, cut your calm down. So this is uh, Inomata. I'm about to lose my shit here. Then force it back down. Oh, back up rather, I guess. I can't. My mind is cutting me off. If you can't force it down, then at least control yourself. Yeah. You're gonna die. Oh, he's going to get us killed. Okay. That was quick. I'm scared too, to be honest. It's my first time in the flesh, you know. Sorry, but let me focus. <laughs> this is totally different from training. Rem remember Lambda? Our training maneuvers up north? Actually, I don't remember. But it doesn't matter. It was the first time you shot real bullets, yeah? But that wasn't the first time for me. Back when I was in the syndicate. Old school bullets. They gave them to me to take Tsubaki's head off. Of course, they were modded to the point that they might blow your goddamn hand off. Wow. I'd already thrown my life away, so I didn't care. No matter what would have happened. Thinking about it now, being young, I should have been full of hope. But it didn't matter then. Young, old, whatever. Jesus Christ, can you just shut up? I got handed a piece and jumped in like a maniac. Just popping caps all over the place. Yeah, you see, this guy is just telling his fucking story while this guy shits his pants and I'm not saying anything, I guess. I missed every shot. All of a sudden, I was surrounded. Ten guns pointed right at me. Okay. That's when I first met the chief. Why did he choose me? He told me to put my life in his hands and he took me in. Same for you too, right, Lambda? Picked up by the chief. Inomata too. Don't think about your own life. Believe in him. We'll carry out our lives. We've put our hopes in him. Don't forget it. Yeah, sounds like a real good cop to me. Though I guess these guys are kind of SWAT or something. At least that's what they look like. Same day, cauliflower. 
12.29 a.m.